It could be my final supper on this show. So I want to go out with something hopefully I can do really well. If all else fails, and alcohol. I'm nervous. There's a lot that can go wrong. I don't really have a plan B for it. Cheers. It's got to work. What are your semi-final clinching dishes, Gethin? I'm going to make a fillet steak with a red wine jus, uh, some dauphinois potatoes, and a side of what I call LA Sprites. What's an LA Sprout? I lived in America for three years. Out there, they live them. I'm just going to put some smoked bacon lardons on there, check the sprouts on too. And your next course is? Welsh cakes with a mascarpone cream and the raspberry compote. I don't know what Welsh cakes are. It's just like a, a thin scone. We were brought up on them. Like, literally every day you'd have a Welsh cake at someone's house. I'm throwing everything into this. You've got to, haven't you? It's placed in the semi-final. Gethin's on a mission. He wants a semi-final place, and he's going classic. Fill the beef, see it on the outside, inside, nice and pink. Dauphin Miles potatoes, a little bit of crispy on the outside, but buttery and soft in the middle. It's got to be spot on. Red wine jus, make sure that alcohol is cooked off. Make sure that sauce is going almost sticky. Dessert, Welsh cakes. It's got cinnamon and nutmeg in there. So it's a spiced scone with fruit. Sounds fine to me, as long as that Welsh cake is not too dense. You've got 15 minutes left. It's going to be very close. I mean, you know, it's nice to keep it nice and tight, the drama. I really sympathise with them today. Because if one thing goes wrong, that is it. I think the do's and don'ts for this challenge are don't try anything that you've never done before. You've got to just show a bit of skill and make something taste good. Today it's about delivery. I'm hungry, I'm ready, give it to me. It's a proper stressful few minutes with the timings. My heart is racing. Gethin's main meat and two veg moved on. So we're escalating meat and two veg here with fillet steak and a red wine jus. I want it a nice medium steak. I don't want it too raw, but I don't want it overcooked. Dauphin white potatoes, hopefully nice and creamy and soft. Are those potatoes cooked? Yeah. I'm not sure what the LA sprouts mean, but sprouts and bacon is a classic. So they like lots of bacon with their sprouts in LA, do they? Yeah, that's the way they do it, right? All of that sounds absolutely delicious. Nowhere to hide, though. Nowhere to hide. Right, well done, you. Off you go. Hi. Hello. <laughs> Hello. How's it going? Good, how are you? I've been... My heart's beated less fast. Yes. For the first course, I've made you a fillet steak with a red wine jus, dauphinois potatoes, and uh, what I call the LA sprouts. Thank you. Enjoy. Thank you. I like how he's presented it, and he's really thought about it. My steak is beautifully cooked, absolutely delicious, and the jus has got so much flavour. Bacon and sprouts, call them what you like, just beautiful. Dauphinois potatoes, nice, although the middle isn't cooked, which is a real shame. But all in all, really, really impressed. He was just, you know, 10 minutes away from this being an absolutely banging dish. That beef is really, really nice, and it's well seasoned. The potatoes, that is garlicky and it's creamy. The sprouts, I think, are fantastic. Love his progress.